So what are the qualifications that a Kanban consultant should have? So the thing to remember here is, of course, qualifications are important. And I will go through those in a minute. But more important is that you've got experience of guiding and helping organizations improve what they do. In other words, putting the Kanban lens on the current system of work and then improving it. And as a result of those improvements, the organization is delivering more value to the customers and reducing the handoffs, the delays, the friction within that flow. So let's talk about the qualifications. The minimum qualification that you want is somebody to be a Kanban KMP, Kanban Management Professional. Ideally, you want them to be Kanban Coach and Kanban Consultant as well. So those are the qualifications that you want to look for. And then look at their experience. What have they done? How have they done it? But the what and the how is important because you want to be able to understand is it just about do what the book says and do here, 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 here? Or is it about understanding the context that you are at, meeting you where you are, working with you to visualize and manage the flow of work within your context? So this is important because otherwise it becomes a cookie cutter or cut and paste. Oh, it worked like this in the, in the past. So let me just apply that for you here. And that's the thing you want to look at. Of course, uh, talk to them, talk to the clients and take it from there.